Hey, what's going on, Rockstars? Welcome to the channel. Real quick video, I'm gonna do a screen share on it just to show you the story, and this is for Amazon and Amazon sellers. This will also affect some of you Amazon buyers who buy things regularly off of Amazon and FBA. Uh, Amazon is implementing a new 5% surcharge to third-party sellers who take advantage of fulfillment by Amazon, which means sending it into their warehouse, they handle it, ship it out for you. FBA is an amazing business model, and uh, if you don't do it or you're considering doing it, um, you should definitely forge ahead with that, learn it, and, and expand your business. But they are adding a new surcharge fee um, for multiple of reasons. We'll see that in just a second when I do the screen share. So don't let it scare you off, but you should know about it. Uh, also, if you don't know anything about Amazon or Amazon FBA or how to sell through Amazon Prime and fulfillment, um, I cover it completely in my 2022 training package. You get all of last year's 2021 to 22 training and, of course, the logins to the new website and new training packages, guides, private group, uh, store reviews, you name it you get it i'll link it down below go check that out i've got it 50 percent off for the holiday for you guys and uh, with that let's go over and take a look at the story on amazon's new five percent fba seller third-party seller fee okay grab this coverage by dan avery and laura um hatala sorry if i pronounced that wrong on april 14th which of course was friday i believe uh, or thursday amazon to boost seller fulfillment fee by five percent to cover Brrr. Feel an inflation. Who could have guessed those were the reasons? From CNET, um, the e-commerce giant is facing increased logistics costs and says the surcharge is in lieu of a permanent fee change. Well, it's really no different whether you charge us a fee change or a fuel and inflation cost. It's really um, not any different. Doesn't matter where the fee comes from. The fee is the fee. So in response to those rising costs, Amazon will increase a fee charge to third-party merchants who use its fulfillment by Amazon services by 5% to cover fuel and inflation. The surcharge, a first for the e-commerce giant, will go into effect April the 28th. So today uh, I'm filming this on the 17th. Um, so that would be a week from Thursday, not this Thursday, a week from Thursday. It starts um, according to the notice to sellers, the increased fee will apply to all product types, including non-apparel, apparel, dangerous goods, small and light items. The fee, which covers the cost of customer service, as well as picking, packing, and sending out a product with two-day shipping, will be increased on average by 24 cents per item. So that's based on like the average uh, FBA fee that people are paying right now. So, of course, they're incurring, you know, fuel costs on the vans and all the delivery things. And, of course, the cost of inflation, the cost of all the delivery companies like uh, USPS and all that increasing costs. So all that's gone up. So everybody increasing fees. Merchants who use the FBA service, which stores, packs, and ships their goods, pay a variety of fees in addition to the fulfillment rate um, that will increase at the end of April. Amazon announced FBA fees were going up to partially offset the higher permanent operating costs. So that was also an announcement in November. We all saw that. Uh, pretty sure I did a video on that. The move comes after months of concerns over inflation at a time when Amazon has told its shareholders it expects logistics and labor costs to increasingly eat into its sales. The fee increase is set to kick off the same week Amazon is expected to report its earnings from the first three months, first quarter of 2022. Separately, Etsy increased its base seller fees from 5% to 6.5% this past Monday, leading one seller to call for a strike and more than 15,000 sellers to sign a petition in protest. My lord, eBay increases their fees a lot. Amazon has increased their fees a lot. It, it's what happens, guys, especially when we have inflation. So those of you that are signing petitions and calling for strikes on companies that are raising costs, USPS raising fees, all this stuff going up, remember that when you go to the polls. Remember that when you... Uh, make decisions that affect this economy and this uh, country. When everything goes through the roof and the prices go through the roof, the price has to be passed along to somebody. So the new 24 cent per unit increase uh, on average is below the UPS 42 cent fuel charge and the 49 cent charge by FedEx. There you go. UPS increased 42 cents and FedEx by 49 cents to cover all of their shipping fees when you ship packages through them. We all know USPS raised their fees. Now Amazon. This is what happens, guys. It is a trickle down effect. I don't get into politics and geopolitical things on this channel but this is not politics this is facts when everything goes up when the cost of fuel goes up when gas goes up when the cost of uh, distribution goes up when the cost of importation goes up when all of these things go up when having to pay extra for you know people's minimum wages and all kinds of things the cost goes across the board it is not free all those stimulus checks were not free nothing in life is free money is not free somebody has to pay for it and this is how they get us so keep that in mind every time you think you're getting something for nothing you are not 
In 2022, we expect that a return to normalcy as COVID-19 restrictions around the world eased, but fuel and inflation have presented further challenges, the FBA team said in the notice. It's still unclear if these inflationary costs will go up or down or for how long they'll persist. So rather than a permanent fee, we're employing a fuel and inflation surcharge for the first time, a mechanism broadly used across supply chain providers. 90% of Amazon's 2 million sellers use its FBA service, and analysts predict they will pass the increase on to their customers. That's you and I buying things off Amazon. So just keep that in mind. Updated on April the 13th, that was Wednesday at 2, or excuse me, 12.50 p.m. Pacific, 1, 2, 3, 50 p.m. Eastern time. So there you go, guys. Amazon bumping that fee up 5% to cover. Fuel and inflation. Wow. This country and everything about it is just slowly becoming more and more expensive. All right, guys. Enjoy the video. Thank you so much. Give it a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel. And as always, check those links down below for amazing products and support and programs like List Perfectly to cross-list your tools to other platforms and My Reseller Genie to do all of your accounting, inventory, bookkeeping for you, profits, sales, expenses, and everything else that you need in 2022. Those links are all down below along with discount codes. Appreciate you once again, and I'll see you next time.